10khustle.com. 10 startups, 10 people, $10,000. Are you a hustler? What's good, 10K Hustlers? YouTube, MySpace, all the fans, all the talent, all the mommies and daddies even helping your kids. How you guys doing? NC Media, Norbs here, about to give you guys a big update. Hope you're ready. Get about a half hour ready to set aside for this because it's a long video, but it's important, okay? All you guys listen up real careful. First and foremost, we're extending the competition to March 31st. If you haven't submitted yet, you didn't miss it. You're lucky. We haven't hit 100 qualifiers. We're, in fact, we're only at 41. So we're giving it another month. If at the end of this month we don't hit 100 qualifiers, we're going to close up shop and start elimination rounds anyway. Uh, if we do reach 100, we're going to still save one or two wild cards for later in the competition, and you'll find more about that in a second. Second, I'll go over how this all started, okay? Real quick, like how it first started. Uh, beginning of this year, I'm lying in bed with my girl, just having some pillow talk, and I'm, I'm like, you know what, honey? I really want to do something nice. I really want to do something karma-based with some of my money. I help a lot of people every year with money. I donate, I sponsor kids, I do that kind of stuff, but I wanted to take on something personally, me, that I need to look after, I need to commit to. I don't know how yet, but I'm thinking like, take some people, start up some websites with them, help tend up and comers with a lot of talent, not really work with marketers, but try working with other good talent um, and help ten underdogs somehow and help open some doors for people. And so I jumped out of bed and straight up I had like an all-nighter. I got really wowed with this idea. I don't know how to structure it yet. I don't know how to present everything properly yet, but within 24 hours, got the domain name. I've been doing this stuff for 12 years, so it's a piece of cake for me to put all this together technically. Got the website together with the .com, hooked it all up, got a nice video blog hooked up. You guys are all submitting, so you know most of the technical stuff has been taken uh, into consideration real quick and I've been learning and growing with it just as much as you guys have so the way we structured it now all right the way that we're envisioning this now the way that I think this, sh this is gonna work best now is here's here's how we're laying it down okay we're getting hundred qualifiers we're getting the public to narrow that hundred down to 50 down to 20 finally down to 10 I'm taking these 10 people we're starting dot coms together okay we're gonna keep the journey alive and open to the public to take part in the other 90 people that didn't qualify, you guys are still going to be in a chase. I'm going to have a few wildcard prizes. So this is going to go up to 12, 13 grand maybe that I'm going to give out. Not a 10K hustle no longer, it's at 11, 12, 13. I'm going to give out a couple wildcard prizes just to give you other 90 a shot. Don't give up yet. Keep going. Keep shaping your image. Keep perfecting your craft. Utilize, utilize this platform. Utilize the keyword, the buzz. You're already here. You're already getting promo on a big level. So we don't want that to just die out. We're going to keep the other 90 qualifiers going and near the end you guys you will match up with the other 10 and we'll see what happens with you so uh, that's gonna take shape for the other 90 for those still lost on how to submit I'm gonna give you guys another quick rundown first you're submitting your talent video to YouTube you're labeling it properly you're adding a link to our site you're showcasing me an intro your talent and an outro okay if you want to go further than further than that and be really creative I admire it I applaud it please do it once it's at YouTube, I take your video and I put it on the pre-qualifiers page. On this page, the team and the public analyze and assess your talents, your submission entry as a whole, and if it's good, we pass it. You qualify and get your own page. From here, your hustle as a single qualifier on that page really starts. From here, you get likes, you get comments, you get your own promo, you put buzz out there, okay? And you try to get as much uh, people to give you feedback, to give you comments, to give you support, and a vote. On each of those pages, there's five stars. You click that fifth star, that means you give the person a lot of love. If the person's getting a lot of love, yeah, the next person can hate them and give them one star and it'll average back down. So it's a total voting mechanism, but we're not looking at just the voting. We're not looking at just the comments. We're not looking at just how popular someone is. And I can relate to those that aren't on Facebook or that don't have the, the outreach, that, don't, that aren't even social people to begin with, but they have wicked talent and, and that's fine I don't need you to be social butterflies I still need you to have good talent I still need you to be business oriented and know that you're gonna be coming on board to start a dot com with me and I'm not giving you guys a thousand bucks to just go spend on whatever we're gonna be starting a business together with this if you're not prepared to start a business together uh, you're just doing this for promo again the thousand dollar the winners each thousand dollar winner is starting a dot com with me and we're gonna be using that thousand dollars to spend on the dot com not on studio gear not on marketing your next CD not on getting you big that way. That happens as a subset of what we start together, okay? Whatever we start, you will promote yourself through still. All right, you'll still get promo through it, just not in the traditional way. If you guys haven't watched the other update videos from me, please watch them. It, I go into a lot of detail about that and it explains that a lot more of, uh, of, of what's gonna happen with these 10 people, okay? It's not just me giving 10K out as just a here you go. Um, there's no value in that for you guys or me. I can do that, but 
and I do give a lot of money to a lot of charities and all that and I help people but this is different this is I want to help you guys on a much bigger level you 10 people that come on board you have a lot more to lose than a thousand bucks okay trust me you guys can start six-figure businesses with me with this and that's what I really hope to come out of this I hope all 10 of you guys are able to start a six-figure business with me collectively each of us makes six figures. I have 10 of you guys doing that, that makes me a million. So of course I wanna make this happen and make it work and make it succeed. Each of you guys making 10, uh, each 10 of you, all 10 of you making six figures, come on, that's that's amazing. I'm helping you guys go from uh, where you might be now and where I used to be in life, which wasn't pretty either, to making six figures with this one project, with this team. Um, look at this as a lot more than a thousand dollar giveaway, okay guys? Next, I have feedback for the artists. Uh, I know it's odd that there's no panel judging every single performance for the qualifiers and the feedback in the voting process may be confusing. So I'm going to take a minute and uh, address each of you for a moment, give you some personal feedback from the team as a collective and some quick advice, all right? One at a time. There's 40 of you here, so bear with me. Corey, first and foremost, you were the first person to uh, have come on board to the contest. Big up to you. Thank you. You started this whole thing off for us. You have a lot of potential. I want to see you focus your energy on stirring the pot in positive ways like we spoke about before. Uh, again, you were our first qualifier. It was a perfect first submission. And don't think we've forgotten about you or that you've been left behind now that there's 40 of you guys. So we still have our eye on you. Congrats again. Keep hustling, Corey. Mika Ame, still our only model to date, making this easy for me. If I have to pick one model and there is only one model, and she fits. You have talent, Mika. Thank you. I'm looking forward to seeing what you do in the next video and then in the next phase. And in the meantime, congratulations on qualifying. Keep hustling, Mika. Next, Stoker from the United Kingdom. I haven't seen much from you other than that first video, and I think you are saying you're getting a camcorder. We look forward to seeing what you got lined up next. We look forward to seeing some of the UK. Uh, the flow that you have, infectious, clean. Lyrics are smart, and that's what the team has for you here. So congratulations. Keep doing your thing, Stoker. Slay. Funny, energetic flows. Only one video so far, so I look forward to seeing more. Congrats and keep hustling slay. J Riz, good vibes, good tracks. Not much else to say at the moment until we see some more videos from you too. Congrats, keep hustling. Overdose, also really good vibes, good tracks, killer flow, and a strong persona. All great skills in the business world too. I liked your personal video a lot. I think you should keep making those. They come across really well. Give us a, a more detailed look at your life, on how you do your day to day. So congrats, Overdose, and keep hustling. Mike Taylor, MT. Really camera friendly, comes across humble, and the music is up to par, has skill, and is marketable. You're a great contestant. I look forward to seeing your next piece, MT. Congrats, and keep hustling. Next, Derek Muller. I'm labeling you the mini me. Uh, you have more diverse skill sets than the rest so far. Props, really nice to see. Um, you're great at a lot of things. You understand management and top level stuff really well already, which works in your favor a lot. Um, and that'll work for you in this contest and in life in general, dude. So I can't wait to see what you do next, Derek. Congrats. Keep hustling. Number nine, Dubs. Considered a heavy hitter. Old school. Been around for a little bit. Understands product development. And you have content and a fan base across the nation already. Really good traits. All around. And I can't wait to see the next piece from you. Congrats and hustle hard from the team, Dubs. Ten, Disputed. The deep and loud flow that turns heads fast will work in your favor, as will your humble and natural just be me approach. I'll also say this, I will also say this to the Undisputed, you took time out to say uh, a quick feedback to every single comment you got. That speaks volume to a lot of people, so we're noticing that. And actually it goes to everybody out there, because there was others that have done it too. I personally, right now off the top of my head, remember him doing this. So Undisputed, um, bonus points and props for showing the love right back to your fan base that's showing you love and support on the contest. DG, you're well-rounded, diverse, and confident in front of the cam. It's good. Good qualities. And in the next video, I'd like to see more of you. Your one-on-one -on -one or a day with DG. Congrats, DG. Keep hustling. Number 12, Diamond Slice, Mr. Mystery Man. Not sure what to do with you next because you haven't submitted anything since. So um, please submit. Congrats anyway. Keep hustling. C. Gary, Mr. Personality. You have a lot of it and you have a lot of passion. So now that you are in the qualifiers, I'm looking forward to seeing more from you. Can't wait to see your next video. Congratulations, C. Gary. Keep hustling. Twitch. I'm very impressed, dude. Just keep doing you. You're doing a lot. You're doing a lot of stuff, a lot of video, a lot of footage. Uh, right down to, to the, your mornings. <laughs> a 
full day with you. Uh, you've done it all already, dude. So I don't really know what to suggest for you to do next. Um, I can tell you want it bad. I can tell you're working and you're putting in a lot of effort. And uh, just keep doing that. Congrats, Twitch. Keep hustling. JC, still very impressed with you. Lots of talents to mine through. Lots of ways to showcase different skills. And your humble and half-shy approach is also important in this sometimes. So congrats, Jay. Keep hustling. Erek, one video in, the team likes you, saw your other YouTube videos, and would like to see more from you now that you're qualified. Um, I'll say the flow, the beats, the whole package, you're marketable, it's good what you're doing, keep hustling. Submit your next video, I look forward to it. Swerve, another strong mover and shaker. You do a lot every day and have the heart of a champ to keep going no matter what. We've already watched you shape yourself and your image a bit through this effort and we like it. Congrats, keep pushing. Next, David Record, enjoyed the real deal insight into your past, present, and potential future. It's really good that you're not shy to open up, be creative, and let me be the first to say, I hear you with, uh, oh yeah, right, the arts and crafts, you were saying, don't get looked at as a real thing in society. Uh, you're absolutely right, most times they don't. People chase their dreams and they don't get nowhere, so people say just push those to the side, fit into society, become a part of these chains of society, get a job, get a mortgage, da da da, love credit. Get married, hold a job. Um, I rebelled against it most of my life, and I fight it's finally paid off. It's paid off twice in life so far financially, and it pays off over and over again here because I haven't been a slave to anybody for 12 years. I've been working for myself for 12 years. I have done work for people. I have worked. I have been employed by others, but uh, I've been chasing my own dream, and it's it's finally come true for me. So don't give up because it's true. Some people do make it through that crazy thick clusterfuck of negativity. Oh yeah. Also, respect on the cassette mixing back in the day. Uh, I used to do that as well, actually, something similar to what you did. And I finally got my first set of Tech 12s, and I got a 4-track, a Tascam 4-track. And it's a crazy reggae hip-hop mashup refix 101, 1001 beat juggle type of set. I uploaded it to YouTube recently. I'll send it to you. I think you'll appreciate the creativity. But, uh, yeah, I hear you. We used to do that back in the day. I'm 32 years old, and we used to do that, too, play with cassettes and use double cassette beatboxers to record stuff over and then a separate piece to have layers and then I finally went hey Tech 12s and a 4 track for the cassettes and then from there it just grew into you know DAWs, unlimited tracks, as many as you want so uh, I love Cubase because of that <laughs> I love all my DAWs that I've ever played with because I've come from the same place David has I know what it's like and it was it was shit to have to do that and the quality of the tapes came out shit by the time you got to your third or fourth layer and generation of white space and noise you know, it sounded like crap. So anyway, David Record, respect to you. Respect to other Toronto artists that are submitting. You were the first person from Toronto, so big up to you. And congrats and keep hustling. Can't wait to see your next video. Patrick Kindy, also strong contestant. Lots of talent. Lots of dedication to this contest. And we see it, and we're taking notes. So congrats to you, Patrick. Um, I'm also enjoying seeing you show everyone in the contest love, dropping comments on everybody's page. Very humble, a very nice thing to do. I'm sure all, all the artists are appreciating that you're doing that, and you've probably sparked others to go do that too. So that's karma right there. I like that. Good for you. Shay Reels, another female rapper. One that can actually rap with the rest of the boys without a problem. <laughs> that's from the team. Good for you. Lots of confidence, great bars, and we look forward to seeing more from you. Shay Reels, congrats. Keep hustling. Cade Howe. Great skills from vocals to production to mastering and even half decent with your video editing skills already. That's from the team. Good for you. Congrats. You also showed a lot of effort taken into... Sorry. You also showed a lot of effort taken in... It seems the team has a few typos here. Basically saying it's, it, it shows that you've taken effort in every single submission you've had so far. Really good. We're taking notes. Great job overall. Congrats, Cade. Keep hustling. Jaquisha Moni. Really confident and lots of swag. Real deal, woman who comes at you straight and shoots fast. That's from the team. Congrats. Good job. Really enjoyed your submissions and look forward to seeing more. You definitely have business owner qualities written all over you. And we can't wait to see the next video coming from you. Congrats, Shaquisha. Keep hustling. Crispy. Crispy, from me to you, no more trees in your next video submissions. No more trees on cam, that is. That's from the team and me. Other than that, also glad you realize this is a big business move, not just a G thrown at your studio or at your wrist. I'd also like to see more talent from you live in person, either studio time, making a beat, doing vocals, collabing, ciphering, etc. Other than that, congrats on making it this far. Keep hustling, Crispy. Thank you. A Solo. Really creative and has a diverse set of submission videos. Good job overall, from swag to being humble to an approachable personality. In one word, you are indeed marketable from the team. Congrats, 
hey solo and keep hustling actually solo's dad wrote in <laughs> um big up to dad that wrote in giving your son support that's really important i think uh told me a long story about about how your son's been coming up in the game and how you want to help him and you're, you're keeping him on the positive track uh it's good i really appreciated that and i shared a story with a solo's pop i'm going to share it with you guys real quick too when i was about eight or nine years old uh going through my turmoil in my home and the crazy underdog that I was, my mom believed in the, in the church system and in the belief system and the religion system. My views on all that have changed since and I'm not gonna talk about that right now, but really quickly, she, she used to make me partake in, in the church activities. And one um, Sunday, it was a big event and all the church's kids, all the kids of the church, uh, were doing something like this, an event, a contest for talent. And I wasn't on the ballot because I was uh, too much of an underdog. I didn't have, um, Whatever the case was, I wasn't on the ballot. So last minute, my mom runs up to the promoter. I didn't know, but she brought my little keyboard. I used to, the thing I started on, it's like this big, this thing. Tiny little keyboard, church full of people. We watch all the, all the talent on the stage do their thing. My mom takes me by the hand, runs me up to the promoter and goes, if you don't let this kid play on that stage, I'm gonna cause a huge scene here today. And so apparently they let me play. Uh, I hated her for it, I was so nervous. I got up on that stage and I sat there and the silence of the crowd really got me nervous. So I'm sitting there and I'm about to start uh, and I got so nervous and I'm like, I can't do this, man. I can't do this. this is, I hate my mom for this. And I see her finally in the crowd and she's bawling and she finally stands up and you know, you can do this. And so the whole crowd just went silent. I'm the youngest little kid on this uh, on the stage in this whole event. I was the youngest. There's a huge grand piano over there, a big set of drums over there, you know full shit and I had this tiny little keyboard and I finally start and I play and my, my thing lasted for about 45 seconds to a minute scariest probably moments of my life um, but I got a standing ovation my mom was super proud and that started me on the direction of pursuing my art talent career which is which has gone huge now so I thank her a lot for it now that I the years have gone by and I've gotten over my shyness and whatnot uh, I love that she was able to get me to do that. And so, Dad, going back to you, you know, keep doing things like that for your son. If he's even too shy to do something here and there, you know, push him a little bit, do something extra. So, big up to you again, A Solo and Pop. Next up, McKay Gordon, Wicked, Jamaica is in the house. Uh, can't say much here. You have immense talent and you need more outlets to release it. I wish I could just give you my studio to play with for a few weeks because you have a lot of uh, talent you got to get out of you. I can tell. I can just tell. Uh, it's amazing to see that, um, even at your young age, even if, even though you are, you are like the epitome of the underdog, under-resourced, broken webcam, tiny little keyboard, um, not sure what to do with your talents yet because you have so many of them and you don't know which direction to take, just keep, keep doing you, keep submitting videos. Even though the webcam is broken, keep submitting videos of any talent you have, all talent you have. One request I have, personally, I'd love to come to Jamaica some, someday. I'd love it if you could find a friend that does have a handicam and a web, or a, a camcorder, and catch some footage of Jamaica for me. Catch some footage of you in Jamaica doing your thing, doing a day in the life of McKay. Maybe you might convince one of the studio owners that are down there. You give them some free promo through the 10K Hustle. I agree to this in advance so you can show them this video. Uh, give McKay some studio time. Let her express herself through this contest, through your studio. You can promote your studio as much as you want through this contest just because you're helping her. Okay, give her an hour in your studio. She'll come, you, you can take a walk through the studio, do a tour, so you get some promotion for your studio. Maybe book some more artists in Jamaica that are looking for studio time, and you give McKay an hour to do her thing, and people get to film it, and she gets to submit that to us. That'd be a beautiful thing. So McKay, see if you can make that happen, and if you can't, no problem. Just keep doing you on your webcam, and I look forward to seeing your next submission. Congrats, keep hustling. Laura Bucko, quotation marks, she nailed it. Yeah, I agree, man, you very professional, very presentable, very unique talent. You're very humble. Uh, you possess business-oriented thinking already. Um, these are all amazing skills on top of your creativity and the talent that you possess with the cosmetics. Uh, it's gonna be hard for you to outdo yourself now that you've done this video from the team. I agree, you did a really good job. It's gonna be hard to outdo that, but we do look forward to seeing your next piece. So congrats, Laura. Keep hustling. Holiday, took a minute to qualify. Here's why. Too many people from Washington are taking up the spots of this 10K hustle, and now there's even more of you guys. So everybody from Washington that has submitted recently or that is going to submit, uh, do not remove your videos if you haven't qualified. I cannot qualify anybody else from Washington until we get to at least 75 contestants in this contest, okay? 
the last 25 spots, I will dedicate some more to Washington. But to, for now, unfortunately, there's simply too many of you guys taking the spots, and it's unfair to the rest of the world. So if you're from Washington and you've submitted, I'll say it again, you might have already qualified internally. We might have already qualified you, but we can't post that until this is diversely spread evenly for other contestants from other regions. So, holiday. That's why I took you a minute to qualify, but now that you are in, we do look forward to seeing more from you. You do have talent, you're well-versed, well-rounded with a lot of them. Pick something you're best at and do your next piece based on what your best talent is. Congratulations, keep hustling. Panic. Freestyle as well, is willing to go to great lengths to accomplish a task and has a no-fear approach. Isn't afraid to fail. Good attributes. Panic, I agree. Good job. That's from the team. Uh, keep hustling. Um, your next video, I don't know. You got a camera that was temporary from what I remember. You had to get it back. So you, whatever you do for your next cam, I look forward to whatever it is you put together next because there will be more videos that have to come in from you guys uh, if you want to win this contest. doesn't stop here, okay? But in the, in the meantime, good job overall. Panic, congrats. Keep hustling. Wonder Woman, Australian rapper. Very unique. Has some talent, however we want to see the craft broken down some more from you. Okay, the confidence is there, the cute smile and marketability is there, the actual talents we'd like to see more of. And in the meantime, congrats on qualifying, we do look forward to your next piece. Keep hustling. AI Fever came out of nowhere with an amazing set of bars, great swag, confidence, and a recent follow-up video uh, has been, sorry, the recent follow-up videos have been great. So overall performance is great so far from the team, AI Fever, they're impressed. I'm impressed as well. It looks great. Uh, let's see a bit of New Jersey in your next video if we can. Sort of like a little day in the life of AI FIFA. Congrats. Keep hustling. Pan American Money. New to the whole PR game. Videos, self-endorsements, and hustling in general when it comes to endorsing yourself and getting yourself out there as talent. So um, you've already come a long way. and We've noticed. And it's good. Congrats. Music is good. Final product is already sellable. Image is starting to really take shape and we hear you got a new high def cam so no more phone cam videos from you uh saying that then i can't wait to see how your next piece looks congrats and keep hustling pan american money good job reggie hood in one word from the team dude wow okay chicago's up and comer strong flow lots of existing pr understands marketing already music is diverse and somewhat ready for market on mass good shit, man Reggie Hood, congrats. Only thing, this video that you submitted wasn't made for the 10K Hustle. Uh, you renamed it, and it does fit really well. So for our final 10 winners, we do need to see more videos from you. Now that you have uh, qualified, we want to see a day in the life of Reggie Hood. Okay? Um, unfortunately, we can't give out the 10 prizes to single videos. There has to be more effort put in, even though it is a bomb video. You did a great job, a huge compilation if you guys haven't checked it, you know, as well as every other video out there. Check all the submissions. Reggie Hood, uh, one big mashup compilation of everything. So I personally do like what you did. Very good job. Uh, and I can't wait to see more from you. It's going to be hard to outdo that video, I know. Maybe that's why you've been shy to make a new one. But we do want to see another video coming in from Reggie. Congrats. Keep hustling. Nilage. Lots of talent, has flows, has fans, just needs to pick a direction he excels best at and motor forward with it. Okay, we'd like to see you pick your best skill and do something creative with it for your next submission. Uh, you rap, you act, you do a lot, so we want to see you pick whatever you think you're best at. And uh, your next video, we want to see you maximize that one best talent of yours. So congrats, Nihilage, keep hustling. Creep Show. Awesome mover and shaker in Canada. Personal big up to you because I'm here too. In Toronto, we're both local. So helping young talent on a big scale. I really respect that. Small world and I know some of the talent in your pool and it's a good pool of talent you do have by the way. Congrats. Keep doing what you do and I look forward to your next piece as well. Keep hustling creep show. Bondi Arabs. Uh, Paul. Capital LOL from the team. Very wacky, very courageous. Takes a lot of courage to take on a stereotype like this and break it down in a funny way without being offensive. You showed confidence, wit, editing skills, beat making skills, some rap skills, and you weren't rude or tacky with your words or images. All important in business as much as they are in this video. So good job, or I'm gonna even say, I'm gonna even say great job because you overdid it I think. Uh, when it comes to looking at it from a business owner's point of view, you did a great job. I'll say it that way. So anybody out there that doesn't get it and is wondering why did this guy qualify, it's horrible. 
No, it's not, actually. It's a great video. It's a great compilation. It does take a lot of guts to do what he did. And then you can tell it took a lot of effort. Uh, and it's all in-house. He did the editing. He did the beat. He did the rap. You know, he did everything. So um, having the balls to even just film that, you know, I don't know if I could do some of those scenes. So congrats to you, uh, Bondi Arabs. Keep hustling. I look forward to your next video, especially. I don't know how you're going to outdo yourself, dude, but I uh, can't wait to see yours. 39. We're almost there. Wally Wall. All the way from Romania. Great talent, very unique beats, very quick learner. I heard you learn video editing through submitting this video, and I've been doing video editing for a very long time, so I can tell, I can spot natural talent when you're really good at video editing and you haven't played with it too much before. You do have a unique knack for video editing uh, on top of the great beat, beat making skills, the, the production, your Fruity Loop session, hot. Can't wait to see more from you. Let's see what the team wrote for you here. You have an eye for art and a very well-tuned ear. There you go. Great job on the videos. Congrats and keep hustling. We'd like to see a day in the life of Wally Wall, even if there is a bit of a communication gap or... Yeah, so even though you have a bit of an accent, even though you don't come across 100%, it doesn't matter, man. Do the best you can. Do a day in the life of Wally Wall. Throw in whatever you can there with your talents, but we want to learn more about you now. Smooth. Great to have another local. Big up all Toronto talent. In every genre and in every niche. Alright, I like the submission a lot. You got a check mark for everything I asked for. Your flows are clean. You have a humble approach. The product is almost there. You're on your way. So good job. Congrats. Keep hustling. And I can't wait to see your next video, dude. Uh, Zaya, the man with the voice. You're our first official singer, not rapper. Great. Actually, we have a lot of rappers and I love them all, but I love seeing other types of talent. So far, you're the first that's put on a voice and sung and you're a good singer too i like it a lot uh you definitely can sing your submission video was great you have experience on american idol and you work with the mentally challenged kids plus two jobs it's quite the roster of life congrats on qualifying and we can't wait to see the next video from you congrats zaya and keep hustling previ another toronto local from creep shows camp awesome job on the video very diverse talent great story about your life and not being afraid to just tell it just like it was Definitely deserve a shot at this. Definitely an underdog. Congrats, Previ. Keep hustling. I can't wait to see what you do next with your video. Maybe take part in some of the screenplays that you wrote. Um, or act them out, or get a crew to act them out. I don't know, but same thing with some of the other talents. You have a lot of them. I'd love to see you pick your best talent, or one you like the best right now that you're going through, whatever phase you're going through of your talents, and uh, present something, in a masterpiece, utilizing your best talent. Okay, Previ? So congrats. Keep hustling. All right, last but not least, 41, Artistic Flair, a female beatboxer from the UK. I love beatboxing. I like what you do. It's a really cool thing. Um, I'm trying to actually get some of Toronto's world famous beatboxers to show some love uh, and either drop a submission or do a couple promo videos or even one just to say what's up, 10K Hustle and all you beatboxers out there, throw in a video because I am accepting and would love to see some more beatbox talent. I think it's a very unique talent. I think there is room to monetize it. I think there is room to go big with it. So uh, great job from you, Lisa, and we'll see if I can get some of the local guys here in Toronto to do a couple beatbox videos um, for you guys to check out and to take part in the 10K Hustle. From the team, love your talent. Don't ever be shy or afraid to fully come out of that shell. Music is obviously a great outlet for you and we can't wait to see more of your talents, as well as a personal day in the life, excuse me, as well as a personal day in the life of Lisa. Uh, right, you, sh you are saying that uh, you live in a little village and it's just connected to a bunch of other little villages. So maybe take a drive, show us those villages, beatbox as you go through them, show us some, some of the talent as you go through those villages and show us why you can't make music happen for you on a big level where you're at. Okay, we'd love, we'd love to see that. So again, a huge big up and respect to all the talent. All right, I know it's scary. I know it's nerve wracking. Uh, that's the first step though, man. I'm a little scared and nervous about all this shit too. And I've been a TV host. I've done huge campaigns like this for four years. Used to run one called Web Socials and you guys will learn more about that or some of you might already might have already seen some of the footage on the news page. Um, don't be scared and don't be shy. I know it's really, really uh, weird being on that pre-qualifier page if you haven't qualified yet and you might pre-qualify at any time. Do not remove the video. Some of you would would rather take on the thinking, hey, if I'm not gonna even qualify yet, then I'd rather not even be here because I don't wanna be among all these people that didn't qualify. Don't, don't have that train of thought because you might qualify at any moment. There's a lot of things we gotta look at internally. Again, some of you guys, are, there's simply way too many from Washington, so I can't qualify you guys just yet. Don't remove your video. We've already had two people do this where we've, pre we've already qualified them internally 
but we cannot publicly qualify them yet because of circumstance, because of unintended that we didn't foresee. So do not remove your video if you're on the pre-qualifier page. I'd hate for you to think you're too good to be here. I need to see you guys be more humble than that. And also don't be afraid to take another crack at it. Submit another video. You know, it is worth it. Trust me, this is worth it. You guys might very well be sitting in a six-figure business when this is all finished. So this little hustle up front, it's well worth it. Whatever it is that we're asking you guys to do here. And we're not asking you guys to do a lot. We're asking you to be unique and creative with your own talents. So this is a, you know, a, jo a job and a dream come true for most of you guys. And I'm appreciating and loving the fact that you guys see it for what it is. Okay, so next, common challenge for everybody. Since we have a lot of talent and it's very diverse, here's how I'm gonna approach it, okay? I'm gonna give you guys a topic. You guys are gonna take this topic and if you can sing, you're gonna sing a song about it. If you rap, you're gonna rap to it. You can make a track to it. If you produce, you're gonna sample some stuff. Yeah, two things. I wanna know what karma means to you and I want you to express it in a very creative way using and utilizing your best talent that you have. And I wanna know where you see yourself with these talents and what you want from these talents and what you wanna accomplish with these talents within the next five years, okay? I'm asking for a reason, the team's asking for a reason. Uh, my reason is it took me a hell of a long time to figure out what I want from all this. I've already hit success twice, money twice. Um, once you have some, some money, things change up here, things change around you, friendships, girls, relationships, business, your day-to-day -day thinking, your day-to-day -day what you do, a lot of stuff changes. Next, you guys will still have a month after we close the video submissions for the elimination rounds. So after March 31st, there will still be a month for you guys to make it to the top 10. We're going to narrow those 100 down to 50, down to 20, finally down to 10. After that 10's chosen, another real hustle starts for you 10. And the other 90 are still, don't forget, you guys are still going to be in it. There's going to be a few wild cards. If you give up and decide not to partake anymore, no problem. Uh, by then, this is going to be huge. This whole contest, this whole platform, and there's a lot of our, there's already a lot of ideas inside and spinning off of this. So uh, I don't, uh, don't recommend you guys leaving this and dropping it and giving up you other 90. But uh, yeah, you'll still have a month after March 31st before we choose the final top 10. So be prepared to make more video submissions. Don't, don't give up just yet and don't think you can sit on your butts and uh, just wait at this point. There's still a lot more hustling to do. Last but not least, I'll be doing a video too since I'm asking everybody to make such intimate videos and let me peep into your life on such a deep uh, level. I'm going to go down for a stroll through memory lane with the camera. You guys will see a lot of where uh, I've come up in these last 32 years of my life in this crazy place called Scarborough on this fucked up planet called Earth and what it's all meant to me. And for me, this is a lot more than just about money. And uh, I want you guys to know about that. It's labeled the 10K Hustles because I knew it would turn a lot of heads. And I know that for the most part, a lot of you guys need money. But uh, we're going to look at this as a different perspective, that money that you need, I'm giving you, but I'm giving you a huge opportunity along with some of that money that I want you guys to maximize and I want to see you guys fill my shoes. I want to see you guys fill the shoes that I walk in today because I used to be that. I used to be someone that shouldn't be here statistically. Statistically, I shouldn't be here, okay? So again, this whole movement goes to my mom because without her and the motherly love that I did get as a kid in this crazy place called Earth, called life, um, I wouldn't want to be here either. I wouldn't be here, to be honest. I probably wouldn't. Yeah, so this whole movement, mom, love you. Show some respect to those around you that have helped you to this date. Um, I don't really know what else to say being touched I'm being really touched by these guys uh, all the submissions man even the pre-qualifiers that don't make it I don't really know how to say no or not qualify you guys it's tough internally and now I kind of get it what the Simon Cowles and, and the judging panels of all those shows have to go through I didn't realize you know some of the stuff's gonna be heart wrench gut-wrenching and heartbreaking for me because I can only take 10 people uh, and even after that there's a few wild cards and you other 90 will get some exposure still for the long haul We'll document this for a long time and it might happen every year i might do this every year but i can't help everybody i want to help so you know as much as i'm trying to do good it's like ah shit i can only do so much and i hope i don't get any hate or backlash from this from the people that don't win because i'm still going to try to do good for you guys in a lot of other ways so i'll end this video with a last really positive note and i'll say this everyone that qualifies you hundred are getting a huge package whether you win one of the top 10 spots or not you're getting a huge package some sponsors have come on board and donated some some goods I'm donating Beat Software, Beats, um, curriculum, learning how to make money online, marketing courses and stuff like that. So all stuff that can help you get big anyway, without me there by your side and this G and my team helping you guys. Um, so there's your 
quick good night for everybody. Sorry to make this video so damn long, but I had to get a lot of shit across. And the next video that I do when I roll through my life and go back to Scarborough, I'm probably going to visit some of the talent that's taken part that is local um, and have them roll with me. We'll just go through some of the town's uh, hot spots, low spots, tell you a bit more about the Scarborough way of living. It's unique. We're, we're, they call us the Little Apple here in Toronto because we're a little mini New York, but um, you know, we still have our own uniqueness to us. So shout out to all you guys. Love everything that's happening and um, the talent. You guys are what's carrying this competition. I'm, I'm stopping all the ads. I've reached out to literally everybody out in the circuits. Um, one last thing I'll do, man. You know what? Screw it. Even though I'm not getting too much help back, one last thing I'll do is I'll say this. If you're in Toronto, you want to get involved in a really big hip-hop movement, KOTD, King of the Dot, go check it out. It's a wicked battle scene. Your career can be made or broken in this battle scene, so approach it seriously. If you want to get involved, KOTD, look it up on YouTube, King of the Dot. Uh, secondly, if you're in the States and you want to get into battling, look up Grind Time Now on YouTube or just Grind Time battle videos um, and get in touch with Direct and uh, take a shot at battling in a real deal circuit. Again, take it seriously because your career literally can be made or broken in one night at one of these events. It's a real shit. If you're a DJ, DMC, check out those battles and get involved if you want to take your, your DJing to the next level. And we'll stay on top of some of these things and see if we can attend maybe some of the events and talk to some of the owners of these circuits some more, see if we can get some buzz going and collabs going. So again, KOTD, Organic, Rex, Ryan, big up to you guys, I love what you guys are doing. Maybe there's still room for us to work together. Rex, you and I had a bit of a rocky start. Nothing but love, bro. We'd love to work together. d -Rex, grind time, same thing. Um, we'll, we'll follow up with you soon to see if there is some interest. If not, good luck to both of you guys. d -Rex, organic, KOTD, grind time. Don't flop. Um, Erg in the UK, big up to you as well. If you're in the UK, there's another battle scene to check out. Would love to get to get some support on this, but if not, totally cool. Understand, I'm doing this for nothing but karma. A lot of big things are going to come from it regardless. And I want to shout out all you guys anyway, because you are helping the local talent come up in various, various levels. So big up to you guys. Salute. Peace out. 10K Hustle, NC Media, Norb saying goodnight. Cheers, everybody. 10khustle.com. 10 startups, 10 people, $10,000. Are you a hustler? Are you a